is this place? Can we drive the Suzuki? <laughs> oh! Well, okay. <laughs> that wasn't good for the car. Well, here we are. So where we are right now is in an abandoned lagoon. I saw it on Google Maps. It looks really cool. I heard there's no one here anymore. It's, nothing's operational. Right now we're just going to get straight into the action. Go fishing mate. I don't know if you can see that but there's something pushing sand up just here. Could be a fish. Could even be a crocodile. <laughs> but yeah it's moving along the bottom just here. We're gonna See if we can get a hit from it. There's definitely fish in here. So this is what I saw on the drone. Yep, there's bait here already. One of the main entrance to this lagoon here. It smells real fishy in here. Should be something, eh? How is this full abandoned house? That's crazy. It's just been destroyed. Thought I heard a sound just then. Did you hear that? I did see something over here, so we're gonna have a cast. I think we're going to go to this other side over here in the wind. We're going to go out to the end of that wall. There's an old anchor. Oh, sand anchor. Well, we got out to the end. I don't really know what to expect. But there should be something. There's no one here. No one fishing whatsoever. We had a hit. Don't know what that was. First hit and it's on the ocean side. Oh we get yeah, yep. We're on. Yes. Phew. What we got? Oh it's a trevally I think. Oh no, oh it's a little queen fish. Phew! Yes! Queenie! Alright, here we got our first fish. Top water queenie on the ocean side. We're gonna cast back out there because I think there's a lot more. Phew! That was cool. Come here, mate. Alright. Oh! Just gonna launch it back. Could be crocodiles here, so go in, mate. There he goes, he's gone. Phew! First fish today on top water. Woo! I don't know what else is here, it could be anything, so let's get back out there, eh? Phew! Not much going on, eh? Definitely not as active as I thought it would be in here.
humongous shark. There's another one. Wow, that's super cool. Ugh. We're gonna get all the fish. It's a massive, massive hammerhead. Um, it didn't even budge. I don't want to step on anything crazy, but. He was in here hunting for fish. There's another one up here in the shallow. Let's get, let's go over there. Woo! Whoa, that scared me. That scared me. <laughs> Big shovel nose shark. That was really, really cool. Let's we'll see if there's any fish around here. We have one cast. Oh yeah, look, there's a smaller one there. Man, that was rad. Look at that. Woohoo! You alright? I'm not gonna get ya. You're all good, mate. <laughs> That's so cool. Alright, let's try and find a fishing spot, eh? Well, we're gonna try this drain just here. We'll have a look at it anyway. It's probably better later. I thought it was gonna be pushing into the lagoon. But it's kind of pushing out. We'll go have a look at the other side anyway. Maybe there's some fish over there. Hanging out. <laughs> Wanting to hit lures. Never really fished drain pipes before, but supposedly they're pretty good. I wonder if there's fish in here. Well, I've literally just got back to the start. Tide's come in a lot now. you see that? What was that? What was that fish? It just came flying out of the water. I'm getting out of here. The fishing has been ridiculously slow. Yeah. It's rubbish. I'm pretty sure there's a trash can just over here too. It's not that hard when there's a bin right there. Well, I've just done a long walk through the jungle. We found ourselves at a nice looking bay. Pretty beautiful here. Thinking it looks like there's some current starting to push in. Tide is running in, so yeah, that point up there is where we're gonna head. And hopefully we get a fish. Top water. That's the style. We'll see how we go, eh? Wow! So we probably only have like I don't know, two, two and a bit hours of fishing. So we're gonna go pretty hard. Get up there. Rock rumble over these rocks and then start fishing. I've got the Salty Passion P2, 7 foot 6, medium action, and we've got the Dawa 4000H Saltiga with a purple Salty Passion top water dog. That's what we'll be using this afternoon. Let's get out there, eh? Yo! Almost out to the tip. It's going to be a fair bit windier out there which is 
probably nice because right now it's very humid super sweaty conditions i've never actually fished here before ever so we'll see see what we got eh but yeah there's definitely current out there i've only got the light set up so <laughs> i don't know hopefully we don't get too smoked by fish could be some big ones <sighs> Whoa! <sighs> Almost out there. It actually looks <laughs> like a proper ledge. It actually looks really good. This is just the start of the run in, so the current's looking nice. Actually getting pretty excited. Oh, that breeze is nice. All right, we're going to be casting. We'll be casting with that wind behind us, which will be cool. And yeah, a lot of current coming here through the bay. All right, let's get ready and go, eh? Woo! Got to protect your hands from both the sun and the spikes on the fish. Water camera for if we catch and then we can release, get some nice slow-mo footage. Now we have the setup. Up that a little bit. That should be good for a hookup. Quite windy. Hopefully you can hear me. Hopefully you can hear the drag scream. <laughs> Let's go. Walk the dog. Let's see if we can... Oh, I thought that was a fish. We'll see if we can get this to work in here. Huge cast. Yeah, it's working. See that? Oh, oh, we got, oh, oh wow. We got action, big action over there. Maybe last cast with this floor, then we'll do a quick change. Oh, oh, yep, we're on. I don't know what this is. Wow, it's a big queenie. Yes. Oh, this is danger zone. We might have to. Oh, it's coming back in. We can't really get much higher. It's a big fish. Oh, it's jumping out. It's actually huge. Huge queenie. Oh, well, there's many. This is scary. Whoa! Woo! Are you kidding me? We're on! We are on big! It's just a bit of a scary zone in here. If our line touches, we're gonna get busted off. Don't know where it is right now. That is amazing! Oh yeah, it's on the surface. I think it's a queen fish. Oh, yeah, it's massive, massive. Well, this is a scary situation. Might have to get up high here. Well, I'm not really sure where to go yet. Where are we? see it oh yeah there it is if we can get it over this ledge yeah if we can get it in this way we might be all right come in here come on Woo -hoo -hoo. come on come in here that was cool man come on before sharks come, 
We gotta get you in here. Yes! Yoo I'm so stoked with that. We had a few more for top water and then boom, we were on. Oh, it's running. Don't go that way, yeah, yeah. Come in, come on. Come on, oh, there's something next to it. Hopefully no sharks. My handle. Oh, look at this fish. That is cool, man. Oh, big, is that a GT? Big something next to it. Wow. Come on. Oh, just one hook left. Come on. Oh, don't shake. Oh. Oh. He shook the lure. I just grabbed him in time. <laughs> that was close. Woo. Woohoo. Big one. Yeah. Let's go. Woo. Woo! Huge Queenie on P2. That's amazing. We're going to get him. Whoa! You're right. We're getting back in the water right now. Let's go, buddy. Woo! So stoked. Let's go. You're right. We're going to get, let him recover a, a bit first before we release. Seems good, eh? Seems real good. No sharky sharks. There he goes. That was sick. Yes! Yes! That was sick! Woo -hoo -hoo! How good was that? We can see the bait getting smashed by something. I thought maybe tuna. Then boom, big queenie on. Catch and release, mate. First time fishing this spot ever. And the current looks amazing. We're gonna get back out there, but that was sick. Ew! Top water dog gets another fish to its name. So stoked, how's the leader? Feels all right. We should be fine, let's get back out there. I was a bit worried then with the shallow reef here and the fish running that way. We can't get up too high here. Well, you could get up there, I guess, if you really had to, but you gotta be quick. All right, let's get back out there. We got that one just, we got that one out there, actually. Queenie was all over it. There was quite a few fish Behind that one I had just then on, out there, heaps. Well, now we've got one on the top water, I feel a little bit better to change for something else too. I like to mix it up. Can be, can be a different fish, hit a different lure. We'll have one more in here, I reckon, I reckon we'll switch. Yeah, we're gonna switch. Also, to be honest, my arm is quite sore from jiu-jitsu. Well, not injured or anything, just very like sore, used. Haven't really been training that much and yeah, big session last night. You can see here, big jiu-jitsu bruise right there. Change the lure, get back out there. Woo, profit. We've gone with the mint minnow, which has already caught me some memorable fish. Fish that will last for a lifetime in my head. Shoes GT on the cavy minnow. I can't believe that lure eventually landed that fish. This should be a lot more easier to, to keep in the water too. Yeah, let's get it out there. <laughs> yeah. We'll see how she goes, eh? Looks crazy. Could be anything out here with this water moving. In theory, probably a lot more action on this lure. But, you never know. Oh! What was that? Something, something big just there.
something big came up, hit it. That was a definite good sized fish. I feel like I even got touched just a tiny bit by it. Let's take a step on the inside, eh? Basically the same setup, but maybe a bit bit deeper off the front here, a bit safer for landing a bigger fish maybe. Try it out, eh? I might sit down and wait, see if we see a fish. Kind of sight cast. If we see some bait blowing up like before, We'll have a cast, eh? Seems like after catching that fish, it's kind of gone a little bit quiet. I think I just saw a fish swim past. So we're going to find out. <laughs> just over there somewhere now. Any minute now, big hit. Seems to be a bit of a current line here now. It is getting later in the day. I've been sitting down. I haven't really seen anything actually. <laughs> Maybe there's like bull sharks or something in the water since getting that queen fish and everything kind of got spooked. But yeah, we'll keep casting. I feel like there should be, should be something. There's bait coming up from the deep. I wonder if we put something else on that sinks down. I can just go have a few more casts because the sun's getting down. Wouldn't mind getting another hit though. Got the queenies almost instantly and then no fish. No fish, no fun. Here we go. Here we go. Na, 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 Officially last cast. Here we go. Please get a hook up. And no hookup. <laughs> sort of prime time, but I'm gonna pack up and head head home because I don't really know this area and that track too well. It's gonna be dark very soon, so start trekking back. I was pretty quiet in the end there, eh? Like got that coiny straight up, and then nothing else after. Probably, maybe sharks came. I don't know. But still looks really good out there. All right, let's get back. You, the candy man. <laughs> A little bit creepy in here, actually. Oh. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Let's go fishing. Ooh. Little baby goanna. Follow the yellow arrow. 
Oh, nice spot. Beautiful. I think where we're going is just around the corner here. Yeah, big survival beast fire. Oh, big jump. Oh, a little bit slippery that one. It's a beautiful day. So 40 gram shadow color floating stick bait. So we're gonna give that a go out there. Love top water action. The current's just started moving. It should get stronger and stronger. And hopefully we're gonna get some tuna to come past. I think I can see bait hanging out, out there. So good chance that tuna will come. Tuna, mackerel, queenfish. Giant Valley. Anything, really. <laughs> really good action on this 40 gram. I'm scared I'm gonna get smoked by something big. Just had a mackerel. Full on mackerel attack. Yes! <laughs> oh, another one! Little mackerel. Ew. Beautiful little fish. Come here, buddy. Ugh. Boy, he's heavier than he looks. You right, you right. Oh. Oh, he's still real green. That's sick. Ew. Uh, come here. He's got this beautiful little Spanish mackerel. They're not the hardiest of fish, so we're gonna try and get this guy back straight away. Let's go. Woo! All right, one out. Two out. Let's get him back, eh? Sick first fish on this lure, 40 gram floating shadow model, little mackerel. That was really cool. That's that's such a cool fish. Super good eating too, but they got to be a little bit bigger. We're gonna keep the stick bait on for a bit longer, and should be more action. But yeah, we'll see what happens. Very happy to have gloves on when dealing with fish like that. Their teeth are razor sharp. Get straight back out there, eh? That fish came from here, I think. I was just about to cast and I looked down and we've found a twisty. A metal twisty just here on the rocks. Interesting. Oh, we'll keep that. They're good. My stuff is pretty much getting washed away, so... And we haven't caught a fish. I haven't really even seen a fish for a while. So last cast. Ugh. Thank God for gloves because those oysters are sharp. Oh, we're going to go swimming in these rock pools.
not the best time of day yet, but the tide is running out. It's sort of a bite time for fish, hopefully. But we'll check out the spot, see if there's any current. I think on a run-in tide tomorrow morning might be better, but let's just go on and see, eh? Keen just to go find new spots. Oh, if we get a fish in this zone, it's going to be amazing. All right, get this gear off. Very heavy because there's multiple setups. This is my new 6000 Saltega and we have the P4 rod. Salty passion, mate. This is my old 14,000 Sortega with the P8 Salty Passion rod mate. Let's get some lures on these. Just saw a shark swim past. If there's a shark, there should be GT. That's what I reckon. So let's give it a go, eh? P8 rod with a floating stick bait, 60 gram. On the P4 rod, we have a little 20 gram full custom cavy lure. Swim's amazing, hopefully we get a little tuna on it. So these are the two setups I'm using, but we're not going to cast from here, it's pretty high. We're going to go relocate down to that rock. Relocation, let's go. Catch first, think later. Oh, my arm's sore, eh? Oh. Bit choppy, but it's all right. Just got scared of my own shadow then. <laughs> Nothing so far. I go eat an apple. <laughs> I'm hungry. Oh, that's a good apple. Haven't had a green one in so long. Woo. Whoa. Well, I just crashed my drone. I've got to go up in the bush and try and find her. <laughs> You're kidding me. We've got to race. Try and find this drone. I can't believe I crashed it. Well, I had it on um, follow me. I can hear it. Wow. Whoa. Oh, I've lost. We've lost some propellers. Big crash. Oh. How you turn it off? What? You're kidding me, man. Well, oh. Oh, dude. My blades are cooked. I don't even know how we got here. Can I still fly it? Oh, no, we've got some issues here. Hold on. Imagine if we can still fly this after that. Turn it off for now. 
hopefully I didn't drop anything on the way here. We got the drone back. There might be an easier way to get to where the drone was than where I came, but I just heard it, heard the sound and went straight for it. That's where we came from over there. We literally just got to this place. I wanted to use the drone to try and spot fish and even get hits on the drone. Not much battery left, but we're gonna try and manually fly this. The camera was pretty messed up there. It sort of does. <laughs> We're on here, eh? Right? That tree still flies. Stoked. We'll bring it back in. Well, that's about the third or fourth crash. Still going. <laughs> right, let's get our stuff back. Where is my stuff? It's over there. No fish, but we did crash the drone. Poor drone. Oh, we're gonna pack up and mission back home. Airbnb lifestyle, mate. <laughs> I'll see you guys tomorrow when we're on a fish, okay? Let's go. Phew! Whoa! Well, that right there is an example of hard work does not pay off. <laughs> that was a big mission and I'm not even started the walk home right now. But anyway, you never know what's going to happen. That's the thing. You never know. That's cool. Climb up on one of these rocks, eh? <sighs> Trying to fly the drone. Good morning. Alright, we're heading out to our last fishing session and hopefully get a fish in the last morning. So, yeah, yeah, very slippery. Alright, we're gonna make our way out to the point, find a good rock, 
start casting having fished here yet hopefully it's this spot this could be the path to Tarabithia it's been a long walk so far we're almost out there I think we're going to try and get out to that furthest tip hopefully we can don't even know yet we're going to find out soon though Here we are. It actually looks like a really good spot. Pretty windy. Really windy. We're gonna put our bag down. I just realized I brought my heavy rod and my heavy reel, but I didn't bring any big lures i've only got the small lures so no gt fishing this morning we're just going to be going for tuna i think or any we can get gt but if we get a big one on that set up we're going to probably get smoked but yeah well i guess we'll find out eh? <laughs> This is yes. Oh, it's a queen fish. You, oh, that's awesome. Come in, buddy. You. Good one. Big queen fish. He's fighting hard. Try and get him up here, right? With this wave. Next wave. Here we go. Woo! Yes! Phew! Oh, beautiful fish. Wow! Phew! You yeah, alright? Ah, oh, gotcha! I got you, mate! Phew! How good is that? Got some water there for you. Whoa, 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 whoa! Whoa, he's still so green! Beautiful fish on sunrise! Epic queen, queenie, one of the first casts. We're gonna get this fish straight back out there. But that, that is a beauty. Let's let him recover in this rock pool, eh? Woo, ha <laughs> Stoked. Come on, mate. Bit of recovery in here, and then we're gonna go and release him on the side that's not so crazy. Oh. Uh. Oh, he'll be right, he's good. Ugh. 
Oh. Oh, this is so slippery. Oh, dude. I've just smashed the screen of my GoPro. I don't even know if I can put that underwater. Beautiful Queenie on sun sunrise. Let's go. Oh, there he goes. Broke my GoPro on that slip. Oh, this is so slippery. Oh, that's gnarly. <sighs> Dude. I'm keen to cast again because that was one of my first casts. Just out there. I can't believe we got a broken camera, dude. Oh yeah, that was a bit of action. Pretty sad I broke my camera, but yeah, let's just get straight back out there. Let's go. You. Might have touched the rocks once, but looks all right. Let's get back out there, eh? You. It was so dark when we got that fish. They must have really good vision in the water. Out here looks really fishy. Out the front. Alright, I basically cast it to that buoy. Big cast. Oh, had a hit. Oh, hit. Oh, no way! What? Oh, I got snipped! You're kidding me! That must have been a mackerel! Well, there's fish out there. We're going to tie on another lure. Straight away. We're not going to be able to cast very far. But it might be okay. Alright, we just tied on a little cabbie, salty passion minnow. Hopefully those mackerel are still around. Totally snipped, eh? Oh. Can't cast very far with this wind and the lure. One more with this and then we're gonna switch back to a metal. Just so we can cast far further out there. Mackerel and tuna out there, mate. Let's go. Probably not the best hooks for mackerel. <laughs> but we don't have anything else. If we, oh, no, I should put a treble on there, right? Eh? I'm going to put a treble on the back. Let's go. <laughs> there we go. Well, we're not going to miss a hook up. <laughs> Three hooks on, on one jig. I've never done that before. Yeah, I think it's really deep out there. Oh. I had a hit just here. Come on. I'll be stoked. Even just with one more fish. Oh. What? What just happened? Did I just have a... I think I had a fish. I don't know what just happened. I felt like pull, pull. I think I was just getting hit. There could be heaps of fish out there, right? Eh? Come on. Better 
better than nothing. Oh, I think there's a churner out there. We've got to go. Forty gram one though, bit smaller. I think there's tuna getting around now, so hopefully we get one, eh? We're gonna try over here out of the wind. Something floating in the water there. I think I just got hit. Oh, I got the weed. <laughs> Oh, what? I think it's a snag again. Ah, oh, gone another one. No leader that time. Woo. I'm not even sure if we have leader. Bust ups everywhere just here. Don't know what they were. Alright, it's too windy now and the water is really dirty. Not much fish action, so we're going to get on out of here. I don't know where we're going next, but we'll find somewhere. Let's go. <laughs>